Hello everyone and greetings. This is yours truly, Miss Yolanda Hall, and I'm here today to introduce to some and to show others another talent uh, gift that the Lord has given me. And I've been doing this for many, many years. And um, I'm gonna keep it sort of, you know, short and tight if I can. But that's um, baking. I've been baking sweets from since I was a little girl. But sometimes, you know, I stop, I put it on pause and get into other things. So one thing I did not let go of is baking sweet potato pies. And if you know anyone that know me, they'll know that I bake my pies every now and then, normally like around maybe Thanksgiving time. Um, that's usually when I bake them or if something just hit me and I want to bake them. But now I think I might go into baking them because I usually sell them. And sometimes I just do it out of kindness in my heart, bake them and give them away. But um, I just want to let you know that the reason I'm doing it today is I'm going to surprise my Indiana loved ones, my sweethearts, my family here in Indiana with some of my famous sweet potato pies. Um, I'm going to bake them and distribute them. They won't have to pay this time. Now, some of them claim that I owe them sweet potato pies for their birthday. They put in orders. I mean, now if you're going to put in an order, at least say one or maybe two, but they put in orders. You know how family is. Uh, I want one uh, regular. I want a two deep dish and I want one with coconut. Hold up now. Because, you know, you know, you bake it or cook it, whatever, what do, what do uh, it's supposed to be? Little. Little amount. Okay. Well, I just say, ingredients cost money. You have to pay for ingredients. So, family, sort of, you know, you put your order in, throwing it out there at you, try to be considerate and reasonable that I'm not rich. I'm not rich. My daughter Daisy told me, she said, Mama, you always said you didn't hit the lottery. No, I don't play the lottery. So, quite natural, that means that I didn't hit it. So, that's why I said, Daisy, if you don't play it, how you going to hit it? Now, if somebody else hit it and want to bless you, I'm right here. I'm open. So, I'm back to my sweet potato pies. So, this is Yoli's kitchen. This is my kitchen. I would I desire a larger, a bigger kitchen. If someone likes to donate their kitchen for me to cook in, bake in, just let me know. Now, so I have, you know, my sweet potatoes. I have one bowl right here. Uh, the potatoes, they're already done. And I also have some in this big pot. And I already have um, melted my butter. I melted my butter. I'm not going to tilt it. Now I have some of my ingredients here. And right here are my pie crust. Uh oh My pie crust. And um, yes, in family, I do have a few deep dish. Not a lot. Because deep dish takes a lot of potatoes. So I'm just doing a few uh, for today. And the reason why I said today is because tomorrow is two. 14, 14, Valentine's Day. Now, if somebody do want to play the lottery, think about those numbers. 2, 14, 14. Oh, okay, I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop leaving it alone. But, excuse me. Oh, yeah, then uh, I already have uh, beat my eggs. Woo, 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 woo. I beat my eggs. And um, I had a real cute apron. I bought an apron, but I don't know where it's at. I couldn't find it because, like I said, I don't bake a lot. Uh, you know, normally I cook, I put on a regular, you know, house t-shirt and stuff. But since, you know, coming to my viewing audience, I just want to put on something red and black, you know. So, therefore, yes. Oh, and then some people uh, put in their orders, they like coconut. They like to, for me to put coconut in my uh, sweet potato pies for them. So, I got some coconut. I think it's my son, Maurice. And I'm not sure who else on the other ones that like, um... You know, coconut. Whew. Okay. I had a few interruptions, but I'm back. Now, so I will be um, mixing the pies, all the mixture, getting it together, and uh, putting it in the oven. 
and I give you a sneak peek of you know the pies, you know, baking in the oven. And then you know I love my thankful monies. So I'm going to have some thankful monies after um, the pies are ready. I distribute them, and the different ones, you know, I distribute them too once they, um, you know, taste them and eat them. I'm gonna let them tell you what they think about you know my pies and if you like to place an order. So like I was saying, I'm going to let them tell you what they think. And then if you like, you can um, put an order in and they can let you know. Now, as far as a lot of, there have been folks that have asked me to freeze them and send them out of town. I've never done that before because I don't know how they would taste um, after they throw out and then you warm them. But I'm going to try that. I'm going to try, I'm going to try free, freezing some and then thawing them out and let, you know, um, let the ones that love my pies, I'm let them taste them. And let them tell you what they think, how they taste. And um, so I'm going to get busy now, doing my mix, getting them ready. And Okay, I just want to show you that I've been in the process of beginning to mix the pies. So I have peeled them. They're ready for their ingredients. So stay tuned. Okay, now in the process of mixing, mixing the batter, see, I don't want to waste, but that's what I'm doing, mixing the batter now. Something that I love to do, um, bake sweet potato pies. I used to do pecan pies, apple pies, um, upside down, upside down pineapple cakes. Um, what else I used to bake? Um, I don't know, just a variety of um, sweets I used to bake. So, um, but right now I'm just sticking with the sweet potato pies. I may venture into other things later, maybe in the future, I'm not sure. But um, to my family, I just want to say, I love you all. I love you all from all around the world, my extended family, my new sisters, my new children, my grandbabies. I love all of you all. So that's why I'm doing this, these sweet potato pies, because tomorrow we're the all around the world's love day. So, even though they say um, um, the 14th, February 14th is Love Day, we know love is supposed to be every day and it's supposed to show people love, our family, friends, whoever, gotta love everybody every day, not just on February 14th. It's just like your birthdays, um, special anniversary, things like that. You give extra extra love and you know gifts and things like that show extra more but we're supposed to give and uh, give our love our heart every day to everyone even our enemies our foes and i'm quite sure you have some too but it's okay because our lord and savior he have enemies too we have people that don't love him uh they didn't then they don't now so i'm going to get back to my mixing um the batter for uh, the sweet potato pies and um, the ones that don't get a chance to taste them this time, hopefully soon in the future you'll get a chance to uh, sample and taste my pies. Okay? Already put a lot of the ingredients in already. And I already have the temperature set on the oven uh, for the pies. So. Get it ready! Woo! And guess what? I love her myself. I want to put on a, a few pounds, maybe 10 or 15 pounds. So I think these sweet potato pies will help me do that. What do you think? Here we go again. And you can see I have four pies ready. To go in the oven. Two deep dish and two regular. And coconut. Yummy, yummy coconut. So, um, 
They will be ready real soon for us to sample. So, one, two, three, four. And now I'm about to put them in the oven. Okay, you, you all don't know how much it takes for me to try to record and things like that. I get a lot of interruptions from phone calls to ooh, buzzing text messages. But so, bottom line, I just want to say this. Now, since I've been talking, what, 10, 15 minutes, what, how long it take, it took for me to get this video together. I have made some changes in the video. And I just like to say, you out there, my loved ones that really enjoyed my pies, or someone that want to take a sample, get a sample pie. Um, if you can tell me four things that I have changed in my surroundings, in this small surrounding since the video been going on, you would get a free pie. Now, this is only for the first person. The first person did comment and could name four things. Four. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Four things that I have changed um, since, like I said, the video been going on, then you will get a free pie. Okay? My children, they don't know I'm doing this. It's just me. You heard some boys. The boys in the back. They're in the bed now. And so, um, Vicky can't eat sweet potato pie. She are trying to pinch off the crust. She can eat the crust. So I have to tell Vicky, these pies are up for other people. So Vicky, leave the crust alone. So, and for my Chicago family, no, I haven't left you all. I haven't forgotten about you all. Um, when I come there, I'm not going to make no promise, but I'm going to say whenever, one day, when I come there, I promise either to bring, to bring, bring you some pies or to bake some when I get there. Or, like I said earlier, if I freeze them and they taste good, everybody like them, then I will start freezing them and then send them like that during orders. Um, to my beautiful niece, Tasha, in Kentucky. I haven't forgotten about you, Sal. I haven't forgotten about you. We're going to do something about that. Give you a pie. And I'm so glad that you're doing well. And uh, my nephew in Chicago. You all call him Willie, but I call him my Teletubby. I haven't forgotten about you, Willie. Um, see, these are special people that came to me and they want their pie. And guess what? Can never forget mama. Can never forget my mommy. And um, she always let me know she wants some pie. Not one, she's just like my children. She'll never say one or two. Mama want pies. And she don't want no bite. Now, you know she be saying she want a bite, but these times she don't want no bite. She want the whole pie in two or three at a time. So, but she's really now, like now the only one can get, um, I say, free pies and I know she can't get me that she want because I'm gonna have sense for her. So I'm not gonna give you three or four pies, mama, no. So, uh, but I love you. And, um, and so I just wanna let you all know that this is what I'm doing. I'm doing my, um, my sweet potato pies. And um, so like I said, if you can name four changes I've made, I guess I put up the four changes I've made in the video um, the first person, then you will receive a free pie. So as the video go on, I know this is at the end, so that's a good thing. Look around, you have to go back and listen to me again and um, choose those four things um, that I changed. At first, I didn't do it on purpose, I noticed it myself. I'm like, whoa, okay. So, um, uh, four things I did. Okay. So now I gotta get some rest because I've been whipping, whipping that batter and you know doing this and the other, cleaning the house and taking care of the children. You know what a mother does. So but I want to tell you I love you all. I thank you for your support, helping me out. And guess what? If you all would like to donate anything, you know, to this cooking baking ministry, I will gladly receive it. I was glad to receive it. And if you want to maybe donate um, uh, another kitchen. You know, Lord may bless. You know, you never know. I may end up, you know, open up a bakery one day. I, I don't know. I see. But praise God. I just thank you all for uh, tuning in. And 
I can't wait to sap these pies myself. I know I'm in the, eating the whole one. I've not at one time. No, not at one time, but I have learned not to do that. Even though I do want to um, gain some weight. So therefore, look around, see what I changed, and try to be the first winner. Try to be the winner to get that free pie. And, um, and listen, and uh, stay tuned for part two of Yoli's Kitchen so you can hear the thankful moanies uh, as far as maybe it should be taste, taste for moanies. Well, I should leave that alone. <laughs> Woo, I, can, I can hear my niece and nephew laughing at me right now because I have some hilarious nieces and nephews. But I love you all. I love all of my nieces and nephews so much. Some of them, they be going way up here. Some of them be going way down there. But that's okay. When we was young, we did the same thing. Oh, well, I ain't going to say the same thing. But I said we did some wild things, some, some fun things. But I love you all. Thank you. Enjoy the pie. The ones that can for now. But I got you, Chicago. I got you. And I would like to say, I give a special thanks to my children. There, I have a couple of children that's been there for me. They didn't have my back for years, helping me out financially, spiritually, naturally. I mean, babysitting, um, just doing a lot of things for me. And I tell you, I love you. I love you all, my babies, for having mama's back. And, um, even through me being sick, times I was in the hospital, things like that. So I know these sweet potato pies are just a small, it's a small thing, but it's just the beginning. And so it's a small token of my love to show you all on Valentine's Day that mommy love you all. Thank you. And um, so as I have, um, Missy is the oldest. She likes for me to say that she's my oldest child. Uh, Vic is the baby and all the in-between. So uh, I love you all and keep up the good work and what you all are doing and stay encouraged. No matter what you're going through, stay encouraged. And um, enjoy Mommy's Pies from Yoli's Kitchen.